question is about how to dress. I think this is a particularly interesting question. I've heard so many people saying that they've had visions and revelations where they saw Jesus, and Jesus told them it's not right for females to wear trousers because trousers are for guys. It's also not right for, to wear earrings, and lastly, it's not right to put on attachment or weave on your hair as a girl. They also said that Jesus told them that anyone who does not do the that does these things will not make it into heaven. Uh, this has been my fear because I have put on trousers, earrings, and also attached weave onto my hair. I don't want anything to take me to hell. Therefore, tell me, are these things sins? I really need your opinion. Okay, so I'm trying not to laugh, but I think it's ridiculous, right? I'm, I know it's serious. People say these things. Jesus came down from heaven and said, you know, don't... Uh, don't put coffee in your cream or whatever, something. It's ridiculous. It's not in the Bible. It's not, it's, it doesn't say that in there. So when they, people say these things, in my opinion, it's been my experience, when they say they've seen a vision, they're using that to empower their opinion. They're basically coming in and saying, my opinion doesn't have enough clout and enough weight all by itself. Therefore, I'm going to say I saw this vision and I had an angel come down or I had Jesus himself come stand before me and give me a new commandment to add to the Ten Commandments or something like that, right? It's kind of this God told me syndrome that, you know, people use to kind of add in a little bit extra oomph to their opinion. But that, that's all it is. It's their opinion. So you have that one category. The other category is these people are just wrong. They may be sincere, but sincerely wrong in that they really did see something and and whatever, and they're listening to the wrong source, right? But those things aren't in the Bible as far as uh, women wearing trousers, uh, earrings, or stuff in your hair, wearing like, a, I guess it'd be like a bow or a ribbon, some kind of attachment on your hair, right? That's, there's nothing against that in the Word, uh, certainly not about losing your salvation over it. So um, I find it interesting that in this uh, vision, there's nothing given to guys that they should stop doing anything. It's all about the women. So I don't think it's a balanced thing. Uh, I don't think that's a balanced word at all. I would not listen to that for one second. I would throw it down the, I'd flush it down the toilet as quickly as I could. Now, I wouldn't write the person off. Okay, so if, a, if, if it's somebody you know, maybe it's somebody at your church or somebody you grew up with or something like that, right? doesn't mean they're a bad person. It doesn't mean that they're trying to do you harm. They probably very could very well mean well. But we still have to take the, that word that they've given to you and that counsel and that advice, and you still have to take it, take it and put it on the table, look at it, weigh it objectively, weigh it against the word, weigh it against the people that you know and trust and see does this thing really add up does it really make sense right so if it doesn't make sense and it's not scriptural throw it out don't think bad don't think twice for a second just throw it out don't feel bad for throwing it out but like i'm saying don't write the person off because they're maybe trying to grow in it in their gifting they may be trying to do what's right even if they miss the mark they're still trying to do what's right you know so they're making a mistake, that's okay. We allow for mistakes. We all make mistakes. So if you get a word like that and it's clearly off, take the word, flush it down the toilet, forget about it, don't think twice about it. But be slow, very slow to write that person off. Be slow to just think they're a wacko nut job or that they're evil or that they're a wolf in sheep's clothing. That may not be the case. That's probably not the case. So I wouldn't want to encourage you with that as well. But, um, yeah, I think that I think what they told you is ridiculous. So that's my opinion about that. But you tell me, you guys, um, what do you think? Do you think that women shouldn't wear, uh, what is it, earrings, trousers, or stuff, bows or ribbons in their hair? Tell me if you think that's good or bad. Put it in the comments below. Um, yeah, just let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.